Hey everyone, it's Kato, and in today's video, we're going to be looking at another one of the new design options that is available from the new update and checking out some of the custom patterns that people have created so far. If you're interested in content like this and you want to see more in the future, I'd appreciate if you like and subscribe, but let's just get right into it. So as you guys know, the update brought the face cutout standee, which is my personal favorite. Along with that, another thing that was introduced was the option to customize umbrellas. And you guys are not going to believe the things that people are doing with umbrellas. It's absolutely amazing. So not only are they putting regular designs on umbrellas and just making cute patterns, but they have figured out how to make the umbrellas look like crates, houses, different things like that. So I have accumulated a bunch of different umbrella designs here that I wanted to show off to you guys. So here, as you can see, the way that they've designed these makes it look like a crate and there are so many different ones. I just grabbed some of my favorites here. As always, I will have these pattern codes at the end of the video and down in the description of the video if you're interested in checking out any of these designs, and I highly recommend it because they are absolutely amazing. So right here, you can see there are a ton with different fruit inside. Looks like this one has some pumpkins. We've got some tomatoes over here. This one has some bread. The second one right here has some books inside of it. And then there are a ton of the ones with the flowers coming out of them. And I think they're absolutely stunning. The first one that was sent to me was this cat one, obviously, because I have five cats. So everyone in my community knew that I would absolutely love this one. And it's so cute. That little kitty looks like one of my cats, Van. And I think that's so cute but there are so many different ones. This is just a sample of what's available. This one looks like a big present. There are ones that look like game cubes, ones that look like tanks, all kinds of different stuff. We've got more back here. This one has strawberries in it, more flowers. This one has a little bear, some oranges, all kinds of good stuff. Highly recommend checking these out. I think you can really design around these, especially if you're doing like a flower stand, a farmer's market. The more that you add items around this is really going to help to develop the illusion and these are going to be absolutely amazing. On top of these, I also wanted to show you guys just some of my favorite umbrella designs and creators who are creating just the normal designs here. This bunny one is one of my absolute favorites, but I also wanted to show off just these beige and gray designs. This one is a little maple design. This one right here has a cute little bow on it and then just some cute flower patterns. I think as creators have more time to design things, we're going to continue to see more and more designs become available. And the great thing about these designs is if you go into your custom designs, these are all located in the pro design section, which is where your clothing is. So you have your face cutout standees, your umbrellas, all of that stuff is over here. So it doesn't impact your normal custom design space. And you're just able to include more of these amazing designs on your island and really customize it to its full potential, which I think is absolutely amazing. So now I wanna go over here and show you guys how one of these designs would look in a decorated area. So we're gonna go over here, see if I can find a place to put one of these umbrellas and show off how these can really elevate an area.
All right, so here is this. I just used the apple crate umbrella over here just to put together this simple area. Obviously, if I were going to use something like this on my island, I would put down some custom pathing underneath it, but I just wanted to kind of show you guys how this would look if you were to include it in an actual build on your island. I liked putting something a little bit lower than the umbrella in front of it kind of to help disguise it a little bit more so you can't tell as easily that it is an umbrella so i like that wooden bucket in front of it you could obviously use any item that you wanted maybe plant a flower a weed something like that in front it really just helps disguise it even more and help with that illusion overall but i really think these are amazing and i can't wait to see what people continue to create so now i'm going to insert pictures of all of these different custom pattern codes so if there are any that you guys want to check out they will be in the end of this video so we will look at those really quick and then i will come back and wrap it all up All right, so there are all the codes. What did you guys think? Are you planning on using any of these on your island? Do you like the look of the crates? Are you gonna stick with some normal umbrella designs? I would love to know down in the comments below. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, I'd appreciate it if you'd like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.